I want to share with you one mistake that you might be making after your intravenous ketamine infusions. Hey, it's Dr. Ko here from Reset Ketamine. Thank you for joining me. Imagine this for a moment. You've planted a baby seed in the ground. It's very small, and it's as a matter of fact, it's not even sprouted yet. But over the next few days, it gradually grows bigger and bigger and bigger. But yet, it's still a small plant. What you're going to do with this little tiny seedling is to protect it. You put a protective net over it so that different insects and animals won't eat it. Now, why is this important and how is it related to ketamine infusions? Well, sometimes you'll get these insights or ideas or revelations and it's still a baby seed. It's still a plant that has not been fully developed and grown yet. Accordingly, if you go out and share it with everyone and tell everyone about your new beliefs or new insights, they might look at you with some raised eyebrows or they might even demean you and your new beliefs. So when you learn something new, treat it as if it was precious gold. Keep it close to you. Keep it in your heart. Don't tell or share with a lot of people because some people, they may be on your side, but they may not be in your corner. So at the beginning, when you gain these new insights, keep it close to you. Share it with people that you trust. Maybe your best friend, maybe your therapist or coach, someone who is going to really support you in protecting that little seedling. Now, of course, once time passes and these insights have been fully downloaded and fully grown, it's going to become like a big, mighty oak tree. And then at that point, feel free to share it with others because now it can withstand the storms. It can withstand the wind. It can withstand the rain. Similarly, when you have a new belief that's fully grown and developed, it's going to be able to withstand different opinions and criticisms. Please let me know what you think about this. Leave me any questions or comments below, and I'll see you in the next video.